All right, we love Fridays because it's Foodie Friday, and today we're highlighting a bakery where it's okay to talk with your mouth full. It's called Cookies and Conversation. As CBS 2's Jamaica Ponder tells us, the owner is using her sweet desserts to foster relationships worth savoring. For today's Foodie Friday, I'm at Cookies and Conversation in Pilsen, a small black-owned business that's currently operating as a one-woman show. Founder and owner Leah Tibbs does it all, from pop-ups to deliveries to cooking classes. And she's doing more than just selling desserts. She's trying to get us to talk to each other again. And here's how she does it. And we will scoop these out. Initially, it just started off as a cookie box so type of situation where I want people to experience each other. That in-person connection is really what it's about. Leah's cookies were inspired by the lack of connection she noticed between groups of people who were spending time together, but who were ultimately disconnected. It was actually a direct response to going outside and seeing folks go out to eat, and everybody be on their phone, and was sort of leading, interactive, engage, and the way that we usually do so is over food. So I created a product that had cookie mix, snacks, tea, conversation cards, for you to enjoy each other's company and bake together. Her company has since grown to include a myriad of cookie-centric activities aimed towards getting people to slow down and spend a bit more time with one another. Being able to share a dessert, share a treat, especially something that's made with love, allows you for that opportunity to experience time and space with someone else. Cookies and Conversations offers classes, caters events, plans pop-ups, hosts children's programming, and of course, Leah hand delivers her delicious cookies with an extensive and constantly rotating menu, including some vegan options. Her goal is to have something for everyone. Utilizing cookies and just food as a form of communication and as a way to, to, to share. Leah says she can serve as an example for those who are wondering if starting a small business is even a possibility. I basically left my job um, in 2018 to pursue my dreams and things have found a way to, to make it. Leah hosts a monthly cookie talk at her shop at 2150 South Canal Port Avenue on the last Tuesday of every month. Any and everyone is invited to stop by for cookies and stay for the conversation. I'm Jamaica Ponder and Pilsen for CBS News Chicago. Such a good idea. Yeah. It's such a great concept. I mean, we were just talking about how, you know, it's good to sometimes put your phones in the middle of the table, pay attention to who's around you, right? Yep. yep, that's what we do. We do phones on the table, and then the first person that touches their phone, you have to buy everyone drinks. Uh, <laughs> it's a good rule. It is. How long did you say that last week? It lasts about an hour, so at least it's an hour of that's meaningful good. conversation, yes. you know, and then you, we restart the process over again. That's so, always good. Like that. yeah, yeah, there is something special about just having that moment together. Yes. Cookies, sharing it, enjoy it. Exactly. Thanks, Jamaica, for yeah. uh, spotlighting another really cool always place for us to know about. 